Good morning, everybody. So today is a very exciting day for me because we got the chickens moved to their new coop. Um, and I'm gonna show you their new pasture. So they will have, we went ahead and fenced all of this area all the way out there all the way up there and all the way down so this is their new area because i was having problems planting my garden because they like to destroy everything so <clears throat> this is kind of their spring summer fall pasture i will probably eventually let them free range again and when I do, hopefully they'll stay up here in this area. But they have all of this. They can go down there. They can even go out there into the other yard. I just hope they don't go back there towards the barns again. Um, and you can see up here, this is kind of where my store is and our Quonset hut. And they can pasture all in them hay fields and even across the driveway if they want to. So... This is a mobile coop. We can move it if we want to. Um, just kind of give you a showing inside. I don't know if you can see through the screen. But look, they're all in here. Um, oh, I already see one on the roost over there. Or not the roost, but in the hen house. So it's got, oh, there's a couple. Got the fancy dancy old time hen house. Um, got some boxes for them. So we're gonna go ahead um, with our system. We're going to attach a pulley up here and have it down and over there. That way I don't have to come in here to open up their door. So this is their door. Um, it's just a slider door. My husband reinforced it so that nothing can move the door at night. But honestly, because our perimeter fence, I don't know if you can see the other set of fence here. So here's the chicken fence and uh, about 15, 20 feet, you can see the other poles. That is gonna be our perimeter fence and it's going down into here all the way around that way. And it's gonna shoot down that hill. This is gonna be the area where Jenga and the dogs are gonna be able to run. So we're hoping we don't have any issues. We don't have any issues back where they were. It was just they were in my garden all the time. They were in the barns. They were pooping everywhere. Um, it was like an Easter egg hunt when we were trying to find all the eggs. So now they got one area to lay their eggs. I mean, they may lay about here. I don't know. But with the dogs surrounding and we do have the fence up, um, we're hoping that we're, we're okay. We'll keep an eye on them. They get locked up at night anyways. Um, so, but my husband did reinforce the door. As you can see, all the way down, these are pretty sturdy, so nothing, and this door goes all the way to the bottom. See that? And it can't be brought out. So I'm gonna go ahead and let the chickens out. <clears throat> so, you can see, Let's go, your new area. So they were just brought up here yesterday before when they started going in the coop in the back. They were brought up, so this is all new to them. This whole new area. That one must have snuck by me because I did not even see her leave. Yeah, what do you guys think? So we made the hole on the coop pretty big um bigger than what was on their old coop because um of our turkeys i wanted to make sure the turkeys had enough room to go through there oh yeah what do you think guys so they're gonna come piling out here And if we have any that like to um, fly over the fence or do anything like that, I will go ahead and clip their wings because I don't want them going over the fence. 
I think they're really going to enjoy this. They're slow at coming out. So, but we also have our guineas and all of our new chicks that are in the stall in the barn that I will be bringing out here. I, I've never had guineas, so everybody says that you need to keep them in the coop to train them where to go. But we got our guineas to let them free range to try and take care of the tick problem. I'm hoping that they come back. Um, for right now, I'm gonna go ahead and train them to be in here with the chickens. And then once our perimeter fence is done, because it's gonna probably be about 10 acres that the dogs will have running. So I will um, release them to that. So, but here soon I will go in and give you a view of the inside of the coop, but I'm going to make sure all these guys get out and see what they do. So just wanted to update you on the new chicken area. And as always, we'll see you on the next video and stay tuned for the inside of the coop. Have a good day. Bye-bye.